How big is a Krugerrand? That said look at one of the most budget friendly ways to start collecting silver which is sometimes called the poor man's gold. Many US coins that were minted on or before 1964 were 90% silver. So if you have 10 1964 dimes which would total up to $1 in face value you would also have about 0.715 of a troy ounce of silver. Of course as of the time of this writing the silver content is worth several times the $1 face value. Other US coins also contain silver. Half dollars which were minted between 1965 and 1970 are 40% silver. Many people are shocked to learn that some as 5 cent pieces or nickels were minted with silver during World War II because of a shortage of base metals. However this video will concentrate upon the popular 90% silver coins. So in order to get the silver bullion value of 90% silver as coins simply multiply the dollar amount by 0.715. Then take that number and multiply it by the bullion silver ounce value for the day. You can get a good estimate on the value of the coins as judged by their silver content. Now keep in mind that some older coins also have a value as rare coins and that value could be much more than the bullion value. However most of the older coins use the bullion value as a basis to judge their estimated value. This is especially true if these silver dimes quarters have zero dollar coins are circulated and are not considered to be of a rare or better date. So when you look on an online auction site and see rolls of 90% silver coins for sale people are using the fact that they contain silver as a yardstick for judging their value. That value is called their melt value. On some days people may be willing to pay more than this because they anticipate a rise in silver prices. However at other times you may be able to pick up a bargain by buying these coins at or even below their melt value. It is always wise to spend a long time looking at the prices other people are paying for similar items weighing that against the melt value and then doing your own research to make an informed decision. This video is meant to explain the basics of the value of us silver coins but is not meant to be a complete education. That like anything else worth doing can take years and can even be a consuming lifelong passion.